There are now three different groups issuing travel advisories, warning visitors not to come to Florida. These warnings are protests over some of the state's new laws. The Florida Immigrant Coalition is the latest organization to do this, joining Equality Florida and the NAACP. News for Jacks reporter Jim Pickett is digging into these warnings. So I'm here in St. Augustine, one of the most popular tour spots in North Florida, asking people how did they feel about these advisories. And the reaction we're getting is they don't seem to be concerned at this point. No, we've always heard Florida's wide open and free, so we like it down here. But not everybody believes that's the case. I think it's a concern for everyone. I mean, really. I mean, this sounds like we're going back. 50 years. Some are watching closely what's happening in Tallahassee. Pierre Omana from Rwanda, he's here legally and is involved with the group issuing the latest travel advisory. He says the state may not be safe for any immigrant. I'm very concerned that this bill uh, that is promoted by the governor, DeSantis, is, is going to harm, you know, not only immigrants, but also the rest of the community in, in general. That's because if approved, it would be a felony for anyone hiding or transporting an illegal immigrant, and it would require hospitals to report an immigration status. What do you tell when, when you hear that, like, well, they're, they're illegal, they, 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 should not, they shouldn't be here? Everyone is here because there is a reason why they are here. No one chooses to, to flee. No one chooses to be, uh, you know, a, a, a refugee or an immigrant because they are here, there is a reason why. You know, they are facing persecution in countries where they come from. And late this afternoon, we received this statement from the governor's press secretary. As the governor noted previously, this type of thing is a political stunt. We aren't going to waste time on political stunts, but we will continue doing what is right for Floridians. Jim Pickett, Channel 4 the local station.